I've always found that the kindest, wisest people I have met are often isolated because they protect themselves from the harsh, hostile, immature, primitive values of the majority that offend their nature and personal culture. Whilst narcissistic personalities I've come across are very popular, surrounded by an entourage of yes people who validate and celebrate them, usually from a distance without knowing their personal traits very well, only knowing them through some acquaintanceship with superficial interactions. Obviously, those kind, humble people have little need for fanship or validating others, whilst narcissists live off of that as an essential source of psychological survival. However, it makes the nature of our social realm inexplicable to me. For the kindest, good-hearted people to be lonely to protect their sanctity, and the selfish and abusive to be sensationalized because of some superficial charm factor such as looks, status, finances, image, performative grandiosity, noble narcissist typical virtue signals, or whatever other trait they obtain or exploit so they can project an appealing persona and continue to shun accountability whilst being continually validated. What a fuzzy, funny, free will world we live in. <laughs>